in our business, we dwell on the losses a lot more than we enjoy the wins. And it was a little over a year ago, actually a year ago next week, that we appeared at the Syntic committee meeting for the first time. I think we had David Beckham in tow. Um, we talked about uh, the vision for what this project could do for this community. And uh, on behalf of the team and Davis family, um, we're amazed at what was accomplished by a lot of the people in this room and in this community, uh, and, and pretty humbled to be standing here uh, with NFL approval in tow. Uh, a few acknowledgments that I just think have to be said. Um, first, uh, the Adelson family and the folks at the Sands, Rob, Andy, and everyone there that worked so hard to present this vision. Um, we know we wouldn't be here without them. Uh, and we thank them for it, and we've talked to them about it, and um, we just extend our appreciation to it. For, to them for this, for the governor, for his commitment from day one, uh, and then the faith that he put in all of us, we thank him. And where we stand, you wanted a status update. On March 27th, we got near unanimous approval, 31 to one. And if you go back a year and you look at some of the comments that were out in the public, and you look at some of the comments were coming from ownership and, and the league, there was a lot of skepticism. And we all had to work together to overcome that. And I believe the vote showed that emphatically. They believe that this market is ready. They believe that this market is gonna be spectacular for the Raiders. We believe that this market's gonna be spectacular for the league. And you should all be very proud of that. Um, we know we have a lot of work to do. There's still some conditions that we have to fulfill. We have to complete this lease uh, that we're working on. We know we have to do a development agreement um, and we'll work hard to do that. I think everyone saw what we were able to accomplish in the last year and we'll continue to work hard over the next few months to, to tech tick off these last things on the list. We are proceeding with the Russell Road site. I know that there's been some questions, but we have said that publicly. Uh, that does remain our preferred site. We launched a deposit campaign the day after we got approval, and the response was overwhelming. In the first day alone, we got 23,000 responses, and 23 people put down, 23,000 put down deposits, and that number's essentially doubled since day one. We'll continue to, to track those. That will be the deposit campaign for eventual PSL holders. Uh, the response has been fantastic, a good mix of both local here, which obviously we're looking to build the local fan base, as well as people from, you wouldn't believe where they're coming from, but from California, Arizona, Utah, all the surrounding states, and then you name it. We got people from every state, Canada, other countries, uh, they're coming in from all over the place. So I think that speaks well for the tourism effect that we're all looking to achieve here. The draft is next week. And as I said earlier, it was about a year ago that we were here for the draft, uh, for, for day one of the draft. Um, day three of last year, we held our draft picks, uh, the announcements in Mexico, because we were supporting the, the game in Mexico. And so for this year on draft day three on Saturday, we've arranged with the county, we're going to be announcing our picks from the Welcome to Las Vegas sign. So it'll be a good moment nationally. Uh, we'll get a lot of exposure. So we're excited. We're going to make you proud. We know we have a lot of work left to do. Um, but again, thank you to everyone, uh, big and small, that had a lot to do with with me being here today and with the Raiders headed to Las Vegas. So thank you and we'll be here when you're ready for questions. Yeah, thanks.